Famous rapper Rod Wave was involved in a near Florida fatal Tampa car Bay rapper Rod Wave in near fatal car accident totaling his brand new 2020 C8 Corvette. I wonder if I could buy this thing. That'd be sick. So it's the next morning, had the battery tender on all night. We're about to go to Harbor Freight and try to uh, get a wheel dolly because honestly, getting this thing off the trailer is going to be a task on its own. If you see, there's uh, no wheel on this side. Yeah, it's not looking so hot. But, you know, nothing we can't figure out. Got a good... It's just a little fender bender, you know? <laughs> yeah, a little. a little. Wax on, wax off, you know, buff it up. with spray paint. It's brand new. You think this tire is reusable? No, the tire's ripped. I already looked at it. Uh, but okay. let's go to Harbor Freight and go get a wheel dolly or something because we need to get this bitch in the garage. Also, we need to detail that interior because it's hurting my heart looking at it like that. It's a little moldy, but let's go. A little cold start. This thing sounds so good. Made to Harbor Freight where dreams come true. Just, you know, buying a $20 wheel dollies to fix the $20,000 C8. <laughs> I swear all my wrenches and everything are from here. I buy everything from Harbor Freight. We can't afford expensive tools because we spent all of our money on these expensive cars. Dude, that should probably blow out. That's some chinky ass wheel dolly. 55 bucks? What do you think? Um, 50 bucks. We gotta get the quality stuff, you know. Ooh, 55 bucks. Two piece dolly. That's it. Metal, rolls. I mean, yeah, this Do is it. pretty much it, yeah. $55 later. <laughs> this man complains about $55. <laughs> you know, we're on a budget, man. Yeah. Never forget the 20% off Harbor Freight coupon. They always have them year round. Get on Google, look up Harbor Freight coupon. Tech tip with Judah. Let's ride. We got dreams to chase. I feel like this whole rebuild, like we're just starting it, but like buying the car, I got over this mountain and like, it was like a major, like hell yeah, we got it. And then I, now I'm over the mountain and now I'm like, damn, that's a big ass mountain. We gotta go up now. <laughs> like, I, I feel like I got over the peak and now I'm looking up, I'm like, oh like, shit. Oh. It's gonna be fun, man. You know, you're No, boy, th this is fun. This, this is, fun. is fun. Yeah, I'm not complaining, but like, I just want to drive that thing, bro. That's the main thing. We're gonna be driving it today off the trailer. <laughs> We're going to Home Depot, gonna get some wood, throw it on the wheel jacks, ratchet strap it on, back that thing off. That's the plan. I just paid 15 bucks for this. I got fucking gyps. Look at that. 25 bucks, I could have got this whole one. Damn. Damn, Two. Rip off. So it's been charging all night. I'm popping it on the, the high amperage and we're gonna try to start this thing up for like the fifth time. <laughs> in the cockpit, baby. Ooh. I can just envision it now. Wait, so, guess we just. Oh, oh my God! Wait. Yeah, like <laughs> Yo. Yo. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Let that thing warm up. Let it warm up. Yo. Got it started, baby. Got it started. That is freaking lit. That's um, badass. Bro, why don't we take this damn top off so then I don't gotta climb through the damn window? That is smart. Drop the top on this coupe. Oh, Here. Oh, this is an expensive pull, top. Pull. How much is that way? Like zero? Let's say five pounds. Or? It started. I mean, it didn't start. I'd be like, what the fuck? I bought this bitch since it started. Yeah. That's just probably a lot of money. Still good. It's just wheels. Look, it, his wheels. But this shit could still hook to it, dude. <laughs> this wheel is pretty. Dude, I didn't even see that. Dude, I wonder if the knuckles fine though. Look at it. Looks like the knuckles fine. It might it might be bent. If anything, I don't know. Look. 2020 Corvette rim for sale. Mint condition. Mint you condition know. Condition needs nothing. Hit me up. I know what I have. I know what I have. Yeah. <laughs> Putting this Hellcat to work. Get our money's worth. Let's see how good my contraption works. Uh, now, ratchet strap. Then we'll be ready to rip. We can go for a test drive. Yeah, test think? drive. I think you can hit about. Rip it once this is done. Got it ratchet strapped in. A little custom fabrication around here. That's at, at this rate, this thing will be fixed by the end of the day. Yeah. All right. I guess we're gonna send it. Hope it works. I'm just gonna full. I'm gonna uh, launch control. Launch. <laughs> Right here. here. This is it, dude. Like, this is. Yeah, you're gonna have to watch it and then. One on yeah, he, he pinched that line, the brake line. Fill her up. Be careful. <laughs> yeah, horn works. Let's check. They What's work? the worst that could happen? That's what everyone says. You can let a real man get in there. I, I figured we'd launch control off. Probably, yeah. You 
might as well put a drive on it. Like, it's, this looks, kind of looks like a Lambo. McLaren mainly, it also oh, is. Yeah, McLaren too. Stop! How are we looking? You're good. Oh yeah, it's Hold perfect. On. It's perfect. Yeah. Yo, you know, look at me now. Everyone that talks shit in high school. Honestly, I, I don't want to see if I do a turn. Hey. They see me rolling. They, see me rolling. <laughs> they hate it. <laughs> Oh, oh, Mr. Fancy out here. Who the fuck is that guy? <laughs> I mean, honestly, bro, put her in neutral and I'll line you up for her. Yo, that shit worked out so good. Wash it. My 2020 C8, baby. She needs a little love, but you know, we we out here. I'm gonna flex on the gram, but I'm just not gonna show them the front end. I'm gonna be like, yo. Yo, new C8. <laughs> you know the vibes? Brand new, just bought it from the dealership. Kind of. Yeah, you know, 1,000 horsepower, twin turbo, something like that. Yeah, I can't keep up. That looks a little beat up. Yeah, I bought it like that. <laughs> oh my God. Unbelievable. Gotta get this big sucker out of here. Get some super glue. Money, look, it's like it never happened. Perfect. You want this? It's probably worth a lot of money. Broadway All right, now the cleaning commences. A Rec 2020 C8. No. I thought it'd be brand new. Hey, yo, how much is that thing? More than you can afford, pal. Fast and the Furious. What's the retail on one of those? More than you can afford, pal. Ferrari. Yeah. I used to be doing this in my C6 Corvette. And now look at us. That's the best thing I ever did was sell that bitch. I wouldn't have been buying this if I had that. Bro, I just thought of a name for this thing. I think I'm gonna call her Butterface because from the back, she looks nice, bro. That shit looks good. But you look at her from the front, and she's busted. I just bought a new car. Realize you're killing me, right? Because I'm already getting me messages. From I'm sure. Look council. at it. It's a 2020 Corvette. I've had a lot of people yeah, call. It's a new. We're all over the, the grasses today. I just have a lot of stuff, so people complain. It goes into the garage. And it's fine. Okay. Damn neighbors, always calling on me since I was a little kid, bro. Neighbors always calling. Started, they were just like, yeah, Judah's working on a dirt bike in his front yard. Now it's like, hey, did you see what Judah's doing now? He has a 2020 C8, go check it out. Yo, look, we just went to go connect to the Bluetooth. Look at Radarius's phone Yo. and Derek's phone. That's lit. I mean, what, what do we expect though? Like, what is he gonna connect something else's phone with? So I bought this at uh, Ace Hardware, 30 bucks to rent it, and you spray it, and then you suck it, and it makes it real nice. So this is what we're gonna use to get this nasty mold out of this car. Sandy just pulled up. Yo, the Hellcat's old news, son. Jeez. Check it out. Jesus Christ, Rod Wave. <laughs> Bro, you gotta do like Uber videos. I was honestly hoping it was gonna be like Lambo. Sorry to disappoint, bro. I can't get the Lambo yet. <laughs> One day. She's looking so clean, got her washed up, got the interior looking as mint as possible. Literally the leather has a little bit of an impression from the stupid rim being in there, but 
Uh oh. <laughs> it's all right. We'll, we're gonna make it look perfect. And now, time to put it in the garage. Yeah, so code enforcement doesn't keep messing with me. I'm just chasing my dreams out here. Dude, that interior is so sick. This is gonna be rags to riches. I feel like when I listen to that song, it just like it hits different. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I want to listen to like that song with like Rod next to me, like in the passenger. Definitely don't let his ass drive. Oh. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. You know. Uh. He's like, fuck this kid. <laughs> <laughs> Watch this. Z mode. Oh. Power steering so good, it's like you can't even feel the wheels. <laughs> Don't scratch my bumper, bro. Oh, this is gonna be challenged. What you think, bro? I've never even seen one of these. Oh, yeah. Dude, this is insane. What is this? It's like a cheap man's exotic. This is probably the nicest car I've ever seen. You believe it's crazy? It's think... so low, bro. Do you believe I can fix it? No. <laughs> you fixed everything so far. Yeah. This thing looks crazy. It looks a lot crazier in person. Oh, it's a little stinger. I'm gonna it's pop it's that off with a Ferrari badge. Lamborghini badge. I don't know if this gas oh. It's hitting the radiator and shit. Oh. Die. Yeah, Tell my mom I love her. Ooh. Man, you can't yeah. this thing. You guys wanna go on the ride on this one? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> they went for a ride in the Hellcat. Yeah. You're gonna get ice cream in this one now. <laughs> it's done. Load them both up in the yeah. same seat. You think you can fit? Have to get in there though. Well, not. <laughs> yeah. Alright, crash down. Let's close it. Oh uh, no! Try it. Let's just see. Real quick. It doesn't shut. Shut. Uh, <laughs> he, never the trunk in the front. he just hops out. Perfect. Oh, you're good. You're good. Go all the way. Alright, steer him though. Can you push my Steve. We got so much room for fun activities now. Look at all this. Get fucking skateboard right here. It's a better mechanic than skateboarder. Don't worry, guys. <laughs> Yeah! Still got it. Hey, back in the day, I learned switch flip, nollie flip, kick flip, tray flip, all in this garage. And now we're rebuilding C8. So what do you think, David? Dude, this is crazy. I don't know how you make these things happen. You like talk about things and then they just happen. Like most people talk about stuff and they don't ever happen. Manifest. I want Rod Wave to come through and be like taking bolts off and shit with me. That'd be lit. Maybe if I manifest it. Yeah, if you keep talking about it. Like, how much you think the fix is gonna cost? I think like ten to fifteen thousand. No one has a carbon roof. No one has the carbon covers. No one has the carbon seats. Like some people do, but like this one's like specked out. Nobody has these in general. Nobody's twenty-one with a C8. Paid for, son. Yeah, had to flex a little it would bit. Be, it would be cooler. Rob could. Wave says that he's like, uh, I don't want one thousand pay cash for this. And then he's like, my boy said you're still alive. Shut up. Oh, right here, ready? Right? That's on the shit. Who just said? $102,000 cost, but cash on that bitch. He said, you stupid motherfucker, you still alive. So I'm sitting here in this car, and this shit's just so crazy. Six months ago, or five months ago, I drove my buddies. And at that moment, I didn't even think, not even that moment, like, until like a month ago, until I seen the music video, I didn't even like know this was what I was working after. When I look back at that video now, it clicks. I'm like, damn, this whole time I've been working at this. But I didn't even know this was a goal. Like, I've been wanting this car for six months. Like, I just know I always wanted one. And when I seen the music video, it clicked. I was like, that's the car. Like, that's the one I'm getting. Like, I guess the one I need to get and then even then I was like bro but it's probably gonna go for a lot this that I probably can't get it like a thousand excuses came to my head I'm like no like I can get this thing like if I focus I work towards it and I hustle every day for the next so-and-so until the auction it comes up in the auction like I need to be ready so I start working setting things and putting things into place I sold my Corvette all types of other stuff my old Corvette and it just like all fell into place I mean it didn't it didn't happen easy but they say where determination is the way can be found and that's the most accurate thing I could ever think of because even though you don't know the way or the path if you're determined and you want something, you don't need to know the way. You just gotta keep working towards it and you'll get there because we're here. I can tell you firsthand that that's how it is. Because this is crazy, man. Like, I never thought in a million years I would have this car. And here we are. We got this car. <sighs> But that's not a, that's not true though because I knew I could have this car. But it's just like I never would imagine we're actually here. And yeah, it's wrecked and shit. But your boy's gonna fix that, so I'm not worried about that. I couldn't buy a brand new one, but I figured out a way to get one. That's the thing that you guys gotta understand. Just because you can't afford it doesn't mean you can't figure out how to get it. And I always say that because anything's possible when you put your mind to it and you don't just give up and say, oh, I can't afford that, or oh, I th there's no way. Like that's what people do their whole lives. 
and I'd much rather have this car with the story behind it and being Rod Waves, one of my favorite. I do. I listen to Rod Waves like every day, and I'd much rather have this car over any other car in the world because the fact I'm going to be able to fix this, like in the story behind it, is just so sick, in my opinion. And I'm sure a lot of you guys can agree. But honestly, I'm just blown away that six months. I said, mark my words, I will have one. Here's the video. All right, everyone. So that's going to be a wrap of this video. I got some light here. I'm in the Z06, and life is good. I mean, it might not be a C8, but count your blessings. This car car still freaking sick. sick but one day, one day we will have that c8 mark my words mark my words baby and look at we're here in the c8 rod wave c8 so from now on if i say mark my words i didn't even know at that time i would have a c8 like i was just like putting it out there like because i wanted one i knew i'm gonna work hard and work hard and work hard but like i said where determination is the way can be found i didn't know the way i just was determined to better myself from where i was at not be content with where i'm at not be content with just a 2011 z06 that's a nice car but you know you can't be content with anything you can be grateful i'm grateful to be where i am now but never get content because when you get content you stop moving forward and the key in life so far that i'm young i don't know a lot but the key in life is keep moving forward tj hunt says that but you can't be stagnant in this life you got to keep working towards it you get depressed for me i get depressed i cannot not be progressing in life no matter what it is if it's in my whips if it's in my fitness if it's in my mental if it's in my physical everything i gotta get better every single day or at least be trying to get better every single day because if not it fucks with my head before i bought this all i thought about was like i would just go to bed thinking like if i buy this car if i buy this car i imagine me doing what i'm doing right now sitting in it like i literally it's all i would think about i was consumed by it i was i don't know it's just crazy, man. Put your mind after things and you'll get it, I promise you. But you have to work smart. You can't just work hard. Work smarter, not harder. I'm serious. It sounds kind of funny sometimes, but people always say that. But I'm serious. Don't just work your ass off. You got to be strategic with how you work and how you move your money and how you spend your money. You can't just work your ass off and expect to get nice things because if you don't use your money right and don't spend your money right and don't save your money right, you're done. You ain't going to have shit because they all go hand to hand. They all relate like perfectly to get where you want to go. But that's all I have to say. I hope you guys uh hope you guys can get something out of me sharing this, but yeah, that's all I have to say.